Okay, first of all, yes, I got a haircut. It is shorter than it's been in a very long time. It's really shorter than I want it to be, but I did that on purpose because this is the last chance I'm gonna have to have a haircut before I go back to school, and I want it to be able to grow out some. I won't be able to get another one for a long time, for a few months probably, is what I'm saying, because this time of year gets super busy with back to school stuff. Number two, you're going to see a lot of videos in the next couple of months where my hair is longer pre-haircut. That's because over the summer I pre-film a lot of videos to show this time of year because I'm so busy that I don't have time to film and edit and do all the usual stuff. Teaching really takes over. Number three, there's an empty chair next to me, except it's not really empty. Paul was just sitting here watching a video on my computer with me, and Baron decided to sit in the chair when he left, so Baron is sitting in that chair. You just can't see him because he's little. In this video, this is number four, I suppose, I'll be unboxing this bag. It has three items from the Coach Peanuts collection things that sold out pretty much immediately. So I'm gonna open these and show them to you. I'm very excited about these pieces and we'll talk about them and see a little bit about how they work, a little modeling. And I'll tell you why I got these pieces because I have talked before about animation, cartoony stuff not really being my thing, but there's a reason for this, so stay tuned. <laughs> YouTube, Autumn Beckman here. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. My channel is all about luxury living on a budget, from high-end luxury handbags and small goods to the everyday luxuries of life. If that sounds interesting to you, please make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification icon to be notified when I post new videos, and be sure to like the videos if you enjoy. And one of the perks of subscribing to my YouTube channel is that you get to see my community post on your YouTube homepage. That's where I post deals, discount codes, sales, and rare finds related to these beautiful things we love. I didn't know that the Coach Peanuts collection was even coming out. I got the email about it like a lot of other people did. Winnie talked about that in her recent Coach Peanuts collection video. I will link her video below if you missed it because she went to the Coach outlet and showed several of these pieces in her video. Ooh, I'm excited about these. Take the receipts out. I have never really been into peanuts and I also have not been into cartoons on my bags and things, but a couple of these pieces spoke to me and and I will explain why, and it's actually fortunate that Baron is here because he has something to do with that. I'm not sure which of the three pieces I should show you first. I guess it doesn't really matter. Let me do this one first that I won't hold up because you can see what it is because the bag is clear and there's no tissue around it. Where is the opening? Here it is. Just wrapped in a little plastic bag. This is adorable. Okay, I'm gonna take the little styrofoam pieces off that are protecting the zipper pull and the tabs. Are you ready? Here we go. This is the Coach Mini Boxy Cosmetic. By the way, all of these are outlet items. This Peanuts collaboration was released on the outlet only and not in the boutiques, but they're all pretty fabulous pieces. So the Coach Mini Boxy Cosmetic, I will give you a spin. Apparently Yota has started making fun of me for saying that I'm giving things a spin, but it's very helpful. Is it not, you can go over to Yoda's channel, let her know what you think about that. I have wanted a mini boxy cosmetic pouch from them. I think these are only on the Coach Outlet, any of the little mini boxy cosmetics. I've wanted one for a long time, and I actually bought Yota one for her birthday, an orange one. So I got to see it in person, and it's just such a fantastic size. Let me measure it for you. It is four and a half inches by three inches by two inches deep. So I've wanted one for a long time, and they never released it in a color or a pattern that I loved. And I thought this one was just really cute with the little Snoopies on it. Now, even though I'm not into animations, again, I've been wanting one for a long time. So this is the closest thing I found that I was like, okay, I can deal with that. And not just that, but I actually do like it. Snoopy, not my favorite in particular, but the one thing that I think Snoopy really has going for him is that he's a dog, and I am really into dogs. It's on the tan and brown CC signature print. It has little white and black Snoopies in different poses. It has black leather trim. It has black leather tabs. And then the zipper, the hardware, is silver. It has coach there in silver metal, and then you open it up and they have it stuffed. I just think the size is so handy for all kinds of things. Let's see, there's a little tag inside. There's the tag, it says comparable value $98, but that, that is really meaningless. I paid for that 
$49. This is the cheapest thing I got from the collection. Oh, there's plastic on the zipper pull too. I'm sure I will get a lot of use out of this and it'll be the most used of these three pieces that I got for sure. Fabulous everyday piece and cute. The next item is in here. This is a little bit bigger than I was expecting it to be. I look at I didn't look at measurements on it. Why don't I do that? Sometimes I do. Oh, cool. The quality on this is better than I thought it would be. Let me take the protective styrofoam off. And I like and I like this color a lot. This is a little deeper color than I thought it was going to be, so I'm happy with that. I'm glad it's not a really bright color. <sighs> Are you ready for this? It's a little weird. It is a bag charm of Woodstock. Snoopy's little birdie friend isn't that cute. Some people are gonna hate that, that's fine. I know this one isn't for everyone. I love that it's yellow, it really stands out. Yellow is a color that I like. It's something that I, I have a couple of yellow things in my wardrobe, but mostly I use yellow as a little hint of color here and there. And I thought that would be great for this. I'm gonna put this on my speedy bag in just a minute to give you a better sense of the scale of this and how it looks on a bag. I wanted to point out, you see it has styrofoam under the little collar here. And as I'm trying to pull it out, it's really not coming out easily. So I think I have to perhaps unbuckle the collar. I don't know why Woodstock is wearing a little dog collar. Yeah, it actually does completely come off. The detail in this I'm really impressed with. It's kind of high end. Like if I didn't know this was coach, I'd be surprised. But you could take that collar off if you don't like it. It has a little coach metal tag on it and it's super cute. Let me show you the last item and then I'll try this on the bag. And this is not something that I'll wear very often. I won't get a ton of use out of it, but it has its place in the collection. Last items in here. Okay, let me get all the protective stuff off of this one. Oh, it's so cute. This is another one that's a little weird. It's a little less weird than Woodstock though, I think. It's Snoopy. It's a Snoopy bag charm. Look at that, how cute. What really drew me to this one is that I don't think it's obvious that it's Snoopy specifically. It just looks like a dog bag charm to me. And this has the same thing with the collar. I'm gonna have to take that off to get the styrofoam. And it has the little coach tag. And I'll point out that Snoopy has silver hardware and Woodstock has gold hardware. I'm not sure how well that's coming across. And there they are from the front the sides. Their legs are not maneuverable. They are stuck sitting out like that on both of them. Let me get this styrofoam off. It makes sense for Snoopy to have the dog collar on, but not so much for Woodstock. And of course I got the Snoopy bag charm because dog. Looks like Snoopy was in an accident and is wearing a neck brace. So it should be kind of obvious that I got Woodstock because Bird, Vincent in particular, the dogs tend to get more attention than Vincent. So I wanna make sure she's not left out. Okay, there's Snoopy without the styrofoam around his collar and it has that CC print, obviously. Same colors as the little pouch there. And again, both of these pieces have silver hardware. They also had both of these in a larger size, like a stuffed animal size that you'd sit on your shelf. They were about a foot tall or so, maybe even a little bit more. Woodstock is a little bit taller than Snoopy. They are, Snoopy's a little more than four inches tall and Woodstock is almost five inches. Let's put them on bags. By the way, here's the connection to Peanuts besides just generic dog. The reason that drew me to it is Baron got his name from the rescue where we rescued him from, All Texas Docks and Rescue. Someone there, who's now a friend of mine, named him. She is into peanuts and she named him after the Snoopy Red Baron thing. So Baron does have a connection to Snoopy. So this is kind of Baron. Hello, sir. So I wanted to put these charms on a speedy 30 centimeter. Because a lot of you are familiar with this bag and the size, so this might help you get a good idea of the scale of these charms. They are rather large. They're Snoopy. Something else to point out is that Snoopy's ring up here is positioned where he sits like this on your bag instead of like this. However, Woodstock is positioned to where he sits, where you see his side instead of the feet sticking out like that. I wonder why they made that decision. But there they are on the bag. They're both pretty big. And I think Woodstock looks fantastic against the Damier Ben print. I think that would be a good place to wear 
Woodstock. I'm gonna try Woodstock over here on the tab where you hang the lock. I usually keep a luggage tag there. By the way, if you are into peanuts, Mark Jacobs also has a peanuts collection. Came across that today while I was browsing the internet. Well, that works a little better, I think, for Woodstock, hanging them from the side there so that you can see, you, you sort of see them from both ways. You've got the profile there, and then you can see him straight on there. Whereas if he's on this side of the bag, you only see the profile. That works. Let's see how Snoopy looks over there. And these charms are very lightweight, by the way. So hanging it from that tab is not going to pull the tab down and make the little circular hole oval like the locks can do. There's Snoopy. That's kind of cute too, hanging over there. He looks sad over there though. I think he looks happier on the front. So you see profile there front there. And again, it really doesn't, it just looks like a generic dog, right? It really doesn't look like Snoopy. Like I wouldn't see that if I didn't know what it was, I wouldn't see that on somebody's bag and say, oh, that's Snoopy. Just looks like a cute dog bag charm. By the way, the prices on each of these charms, they were $74 each. Pricey, but I don't know if you really like it, I think they're worth it. And if you compare the price of these to some of the high-end luxury brands that do similar things, their prices are in the several hundred dollar area. So comparably, it's a good price. Very happy with them. All three of these are sold out on the Coach Outlet website. I'm sure you can find them on places like eBay, Poshmark, Mercari because people go in and snatch these up and then sell them for two or three times the retail cost. That's a piece of advice I could give you for Coach items, especially special edition, limited edition things like this. If you're thinking about something, don't hesitate on it. Buy it as soon as you see it's available, like when it comes out. You can always return it you could even turn around and sell it. And if you're not sure about it and you don't wanna drop that much money right away, you could also purchase through Klarna and then that way you're paying in four installments over like four payments every two weeks for two months. So it's a little less of a hit to your bank account. Cause I mean, especially those, they're a little expensive. This one I think was priced well at $50, but that's still kind of pricey for a tiny pouch for a lot of people. Anyway, that's my advice. Very happy to have these. I wasn't hundred percent sure about them when I bought them, but seeing them in person and seeing the quality, especially these, this I knew I'd keep, but these, the, the quality is just impeccable on them. Oh my gosh. I just looked at the bottom and I have to show you how cute. <laughs> anyway, the quality is really impeccable and I'm definitely keeping them. Look at their butts. It says Coach X Peanuts for the Coach Peanuts collaboration. Isn't that cute? Also, Woodstock is all leather. Snoopy has leather ears, but is coated canvas otherwise. Their collars are leather. The little buckle and tag are metal. Just so you know, really well done. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. If you got something from this collection, let me know in the comment section below, or if there's something you really wanted, but you missed out on it, let me know what that was too. And I hope that you do get to find it for a reasonable price at some point soon. I hope you and your loved ones are doing well, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye.